Is this rhino lined? How many miles are on this thing? 165 kilometers. kilometers. Uh, so someone drove this thing 100,000 miles. Yep. Roughly. Not here. No. Not here. No? no. Oh, hey, Joe, can you, uh, that sticker by Peter, can you read what it says? Right here. <laughs> no. <laughs> Hold on. This is pretty, this is pretty good. Not made for Peter, by the way. 660. What's up, Laura? I know Tim's going live soon, but um, the guy surprised me with a car that uh, I've never seen. So I figured I'd go live and show what it is. What's up, Ben 1411? You guys got to see this. We're going we're gonna to let the uh, ads go through because I did put monetization in it. And here, Carrie's here. And we're going to go for a little test drive. What's up, Dean? Oh, we got 31 people already. Look at look, look at this thing. What the fuck is this? Look at it. It's a little Japanese dump truck. It's called a Daihatsu. And uh, I don't know why we bought it, but... I guess we'll test it out. Those are all over UT farmers like those. UT, is it a urinary tract infection or what? That's UTI. UTI. You ever had a UTI? No. Okay. <laughs> you wear clean underwear? Always. Okay. All right. But look look at the size of it and look at the size of Peter. Very small. Now, now, now I'm going to get in it here. Oh, boy. Stay here, I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to let, uh, I'll let John oh, yeah. hold it. Thing might tip forward. Oh. <laughs> they're, they're shoulder to shoulder. <laughs> wait, wait, let's fix the mirror. All right, we'll go for a little bit. Be careful with that right stick. All right, Pete. Hold on, can you see? Barely. Hold on. We're gonna go for a little drive. <laughs> don't kill me. Don't don't dump the clutch. I do, but not this thing. Oh. Left-hand drive. Why are we talking about UTIs? <laughs> Whoa. All right, we're in a bad gear here. It's right-hand drive, yes. No, it, it is right-hand drive. And Rod Edwards is talking about cramps. Whoa, dude, this thing's spooky. All right, pull, let's stop right here. Stop in front of these these fences. I'm gonna get out and show them. Those are just uh, right right turn, Clyde. Right turn. Hold on. All right, well, I gotta get out of this for a second. <laughs> Jesus. This is what happens when you give people control of uh, your credit line, right? Five speed on the floor. Look at this thing. Look how tiny it is. It's called a high jet. I've never heard of one and never seen one. Just for reference. Go this ahead. This is me. This is the truck. Look at that. It's like a mini golf cart. Pop the. Uh, how does the dump work? Matches the hat, they said. 
years. Look at the size of these tires. I've pooped out bigger dinners than this tire. TMI. TMI, TMI. First time for everything, yeah. What is all this? Is this where a spare tire? Is there a weight capacity in the back? Uh, Let's see. They say a half a ton to a ton. Half a ton to a ton. To a ton. So what is that? That's a thousand pounds? Yep. All right, here, hold this. We're, we're gonna get up here. We're gonna pump and dump. Yeah. Uh, it exceeded its weight capacity. No, no. All right. Where's the engine? Underneath there. Oh, the Lee car was awesome. Rod loves that chunky ass. What do you mean? Chunky ass. I'm down to 271 today. From 278. I got your chunky ass. Well, it is weird sitting in here, so. There's the, uh... Hello, Tracy Ford, welcome here. Welcome in. Can anybody read that? Is there no air conditioning? What the hell? Well, I mean, how much can we lose on it, right? How much are we selling this thing for? I don't know. That's just his job. Not like, I think about 12, 13, because we're going to change the wheels on it for a better stance. Better stance. I wonder if I could, how much does this thing weigh? Uh, about 1,200 pounds. The whole, the whole thing's 1,200 pounds? Yeah. It can't be. There's no way this thing weighs 1,200 pounds. I wonder if I could pick it up. Hold this to me. Let me see if I can. He is not the world's strongest man. There's nothing to break. Yeah, Chris said, watch your back. The cab does not flip. No? No. Because the engine's behind the cab. All right, pop, pop, the, uh, pop the thing again. I want to see something. So the motor is right here? Yep. This bitch better not fall on me. It can't be. Wow, the engine's right here. He ain't kidding. All right, let's go for a ride. Fat guy's in a little coat. Look at the battery on this. All right, don't kill me on the highway here, or highway in the uh, street. There's seat belts. Oh my God. Not much margin of error. It's on the wrong side. Well, maybe for uh, hair, but not in, not in Europe, right? Is Europe on the right hand side? Uh, England is. England? 
England is on the left hand side. Why why is that? Oh nice, I just popped the shit. Just broke the oh shit handle. Whoa, easy Tonto. Hold on, pull in here. Whoa! You guys gotta see this. This is one of my buddy's shops. And he builds Jeeps. Here, hold this screw that popped out. Hi, Wendy. His name is Attitude Performance. You wanna see a cool car, check this out. I don't even know what the hell it is. It's a Jeep of some sort. LS3 Dark Side is called the Clopolis. Speaking of Jeeps, right? Chips and real, I forgot. Hey, this man here. Alright. Hold on. Here's a shot. Is Matt here? Uh, let me see if he's Alright. It's like we're doing an episode on uh, Motor Trend here. You used to drive a Daihatsu, Susan. Yeah, don't worry. Tell him I'll be outside. Okay. It's Joe with G Motor Cars. Look at this Jeep. This thing's uh, insane, though. This has got to be at least two hundred thousand dollars. There's Peter. Warren, I heard that. Uh, everybody needs a report. One of the clone accounts got got uh, canceled, and now we got to get this other one canceled out. What's up, Bradley Jones? Isn't that crazy? Here, park, park it right here. We're gonna ask him what they what he could do with this truck. Uh, I don't have any Lexuses or Civics in stock right now. One of you is enough. I agree. All right, so we're, we're live on YouTube, so don't say anything that would incriminate you or, or me. Uh, but I, there was there was 150 people on that. We dropped to 75 right now, but um, I was telling them, but this thing's crazy. But what what could you do with this truck? Uh, we just lifted one not long ago. Come on. Yeah. You can lift this. Yep. We did a lift kit because he was using it to snow plow and have a salt spreader in it. Holy shit. And then did a much more aggressive wheel and tire combination on it. Well, we know we do want to do a tire wheel combination on yep, it. Yep, no problem. He put hey, he put a snow plow on this in the salter. Yeah, yep. The guy was using it to plow a hospital parking garage or something. Holy, cow. everyone's going holy cow! <laughs> what what's up with this truck here? Um, is, is that so, a customers? You fixing all the without without incriminating myself on that one? Yeah, never um, mind. Never yeah, mind. we fixed a lot. Okay. Rear suspension geometry was wrong. All three axles. It had a non-DOT approved repair on the front frame section. Replaced all the control arms, all the drive shafts, all the shocks. Hold on, hold on one second. Hey, John Doe, that's not what your mom said. She loved it. Go ahead. Jeez. Did uh, lights, brake upgrade, converted it to air ride suspension, so it goes up and down almost a foot. So it's got air suspension going up and down. Yep. And it is a true six by six. It has a pass-through axle in the middle. Um, it's LS powered. LS powered. So that's a uh, uh, GM, a GM, right? Yeah, LS3 yeah. GM motor. Okay. Yeah. Is the inside different than a normal Jeep? Or? Um, just, you know, leather interior, that sort of thing. Oh, well, it looks like a normal Jeep. Oh my. Yeah, pretty much. Well, maybe not normal. But yeah, not, We didn't. they didn't reinvent the wheel on the interior. What? They didn't reinvent the wheel. It's oh, yeah. 
Jeep seats reopen. Man, there's no room in here. Just like a normal Jeep. They want to know is it for sale. No, this is not for sale. Nope. It's a the customer's. 250000 I believe. 250 grand, and it could be yours. But I'll show you one that's for sale since we're here. He's got a, uh, what year is this? A, a 97? 09. 09. Okay. I saw this. I thought it was a good deal. 200,000 rounds on it. Who cares? I legitimately bought it from a little old lady. The interior doesn't look like it's ever been sat in. No, it's in good shape. Yeah. I think it might be sold Thursday. Okay. Yeah, you lifted it and you put different wheels on yeah, it? Yeah, three inch lift, 35 inch tall tires. Already had LED headlights in it. No, it's not a 97. This is what year is it? This is a 09. 09. Oh, look at this thing. What is this? I want to oh, say it's a 72. Wow. 75? 75, 75. All steel. Um, it's a Bronco. Old Bronco. Yep. 351 motor. Oh, wow. Done nice. Not 100%. We're fixing a few odds and ends on it for the customer. Yeah. He had it done but another shop out of state. Of course, right? And the, here, here you come but, cleaning up other people's mistakes. It's, I will say for the some you know the Bronco market went kind of crazy, and there's been a lot of people getting hosed by Broncos. This one's not bad. Right. It's you know the odds and ends. The new Broncos uh, took a dive in sales. Oh yeah. I I, I should know. I lost twelve thousand of one just the other week. Yeah, the interior is beautiful in this. Yeah, no, they did. Like I said, this is a wow. No, the Bronco's not for sale. The Jeep is. How much was the Jeep? Uh, I listed it for ninety five. Ninety five hundred bucks. I, honestly, guys, he's not in the car. He's not in car sales. He, he builds them, and for ninety five hundred bucks, this is a shitload of fun for ninety five hundred bucks. I mean, another first gen Bronco in the back. We just brought in the other day. First Once gen. Again, oh, bought from Louisiana or something. Yeah. There's a hundred people in here. Awesome. Oh, look at that. Hey, Peter. Yo, Peter. No, that's not a four liter in that. That's a three point six. That's the only downfall about those. Three eight in that one. Three eight. Three eight. Yeah. Yeah, other than they're kind of dog either. Yeah. Ham muffin has got about 200000 on it. Look at this thing. You bought this? No, this is another one. Started on it. Another shop here local just worked on it. and they Gave did, up? They did the brakes wrong. They can't get a brake pedal. It's got... This one's got a fair amount of issues. This is, this is awesome, though. These things are really um, kind of uh, took off. Yeah. I was smart enough to sell mine three years too early and got a third of what I should have. This thing's beautiful. I like it as in white. Yeah, I do too. I mean, these are repaint. Yeah, yep. These aren't museum. Look at this thing. Hey, not OJ's Bronco. No, it's not OJ's. That's the, that's the windshield wiper motor. Yeah, that's That is hilarious. That's factory. When they do a cage in them, they actually make a little bump out so the cage clears the wiper motor. Roads? Who needs roads? So this was from factory? They did a, a wiper motor this, like that? Yeah, this is a conversion. I don't know whose bracket this oh. is, but that is from the factory where the wiper motors are. Who would, who would do something like that? <laughs> they were utility vehicles back in the day. We have 195 in there. Nice. Keep going. Keep going. Share it out. 233. We're bumping here. So this one's not for sale. The Jeep in the front's for sale. Attitude in Arlington Heights. If you have a off-road vehicle and you want to make it even more off-road-ish. Thank you. I just bought that the other day. Yep. This is, this is um, better than the uh, what those garage shows, right? And that's what happens when you go off-roading. That's a sheep, uh, a sheep, a Jeep uh, shell. But this thing's hot. I like this. Hey, what kind of motor's in this? Huh. What can he do for your Prius? Absolutely nothing. That's pretty cool. I'm liking that. And then we got this piece of shit. No, no, not piece of, I shouldn't have said that, that's mine. 
Do you have pictures of the one you lifted? Yeah. Oh, no way. Oh, we almost lost the tailgate there. Here, Peter, say hi to everybody. Hello, everybody. They love your hat. Hold on, you gotta see this. Hold on. Let me get... Here, come over here out of the sun. Oh my God, you did do something with that. Holy cow. Oh, that's what they want to do. Can you send that to, um, was it on Instagram or is that TikTok? Instagram. Um, forward that to me. So just put Jack Pacho. I don't use Instagram much, but. That one? Uh, no. Here we go. There we go. Check. This there, one? Yeah, that one. Send that to me. I'm going to post that, guys, on, on the G Motor Car site. What does is is ours four wheel drive? Yes, it is. It is. Where's the four wheel drive button? Right here. All right, so it is four wheel drive. How much were the wheels? Right here. Okay, and that's the four wheel. Yep. Now what the hell is that thing there? Viper. Viper wiper, motor. Oh, wiper motor. Okay. Do two or three more pierogies and we're done. <laughs> and, a sausage. and a polar sausage. <laughs> You saw a girl get stabbed with a screwdriver during my trip in Quebec last week. Gnarly stuff. Stay safe. Yikes. Uh, we're not uh, in Canada. Uh, over uh, Aunt and Aunt says, you're cute. Make sure you don't leave it in. What do you mean? Aunt 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 says, you're cute. He's married. Ladies. Ladies, I know you want to you want to fight for him, but... This, 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 look at that face is, is taken. And Joe knows I'm a nicer guy than the rest of the crew. Yes, we all agreed today that Peter was one of the nicest guys in our store. The whole, he, he know, wait, he know like the Polish sausage. Hat tells a story. What the hell? Take the whole package, including the hat. Cornell says, get this effing guy off the stream. That's not what we said about your mother getting off me. Oh, you're gone. Goodbye. <laughs> Got trolls coming in. Yeah, the trolls are starting to come in here. All right, we're going to drive back, but thanks for showing us this stuff. This is yes. great. No problem, All right. I'll talk, well, we'll call you and let you know okay. if we have any questions about maybe getting... Yeah, that'll be fine. Okay. Thank you. Thank you. Thanks a lot. Yeah, we need to change the color on this thing. It's That, that was awesome. I can't believe you did do something like that. Oh, yeah. All right. We'll try anything. All right. There you go. Just got a text from Jason. All right. Here we go. I feel like I'm going to fall over the cab. Oh, cute dog. All right, let's not die. Oh, jeez. Oh. Zero sixteen, two weeks. Wow. They said it were surprised. Whoa, oh my God, it almost went through the windshield. And there goes the visor. <laughs> All right. Pull it up front, or pull in the back. It's fine. How much is a clutch? They want to know, <laughs> right? All right. Well, I guess park it next to the CTS or the Subaru. All right. Let me out of this thing. Uh, this thing's got posi. They want to know. I don't. That I don't know. Yeah, it's are getting rid of these trolls. I ain't got time for them. Indonesia. 
Can you pick me up a blinker, some blinker fluid, right? I'd be stoked to drive that in one of these. Well, it ain't one of them. Here, I gotta show you guys something. This is one of my prized possessions. Anyone know what that is? This was my this was my go-kart when I was a kid. Believe it or not. I bet half you guys don't even know what that symbol is. Or half you don't even know what an Oldsmobile is. This was a promotional item that uh, uh, it was a promotional item that Oldsmobile did back in the day, back when car companies were cool. Um, I mean, this is that this is what that Dihatsu you should you should have been. Looks like a car Tomorrowland. What's up there, SD guy? It does look like a car from the Tomorrowland. Worst motor ever. No, the four the Quad Four was an awesome engine. It was in the Olds Calais. That was a lot of fun. Uh, Matt, we're going to pull it up here. Matt, um, we went by Matt. And he lifted one. Yeah. You saw it. Oh, you do know that. What do you think we're going to do? We're going to lift it? Yeah. We already told Matt. We had. To put, give us a for it. We had. Um, Let's see if I can pull it up here. We can wrap it. How much are we going to invest in this thing? Like 10 grand. We're going to invest 10 grand. All right. We're going to keep it. Gonna We're not going to keep it. <laughs> uh, va va Vagrant Loafer, finance me a car. I got a 433 credit score. You worked really, really hard to get that 433. Let me tell you. I am not, uh, to be honest with you, I am not the right store for those, for those scores. I, I can't, um, we don't do well with that. I'm trying to pull up the attitude stuff, but there's plenty of stores out there. Uh, I'm in locomotive, but difference between, what? You cannot paint Ron Gambles, is this live? It sure is live. What's up, Sister 77 seven Slots? Um, yeah, so I saw a great video today. I, I think well, I, I got to play it for you guys here. Um, Why is the UPS guy calling me? Uh, Joe, do you finance with that guy who does car loans that threatens to break your neck if you don't pay? Uh, no, that's called buy here, pay here, and we don't do that. And I think those days are done. Um, I think those days are done where you can break people's legs. What the hell is this? Who's screwing with my computer here? Hold on. I got to show you guys this one video. Um, one second. G Motorcars, I can help you. Yes, we have something for a uh, One second. I got to find this one. All right, I'm back. Um, this is, the, if you want to learn how to speak Spanish, this is like, this is how I learn, okay? No, listen. Hey, uh, the sticker. Yeah. Oh, hold on. Hold on. Friendly things. What? This is how I learn. This is how I learn Spanish. That means team leader. Team leader. Number five. That means innovative man. Does that mean innovative man, Ivan? A mamon meal means he's not a fix stuff. Hey, that means he's very transparent. That means asshole. Number eight. Sibre para nada. That means good for nothing. You're good for nothing. Okay. For nine. Bandilor. That means he does domesticated. 
Pinche borracho, the drunk. See? And you guys wonder where I learned my Spanish. It's straight from TikTok. And then you got the Polish. And then we got we got a Polish guy who speaks Spanish here. Here, say hi to Sister Seven Seven Seven. Who's Sister Seven Seven? What do you want, Facebook? Sister 7 7 slots. And Meg Mag's on there. Meg Mag's cool. Are you on Facebook? Or we're on, we're on, we're on uh, YouTube. YouTube. My sis in law is from Argentina. Taught me the same way. Uh, I speak a little bit of Spanish. I am muffin. I, they said, hola lindo. <laughs> What did I say? What? Nothing. <laughs> what? <laughs> hey, uh, Patricio. Hold on. They're trying to teach me Spanish. Where'd it go? Hold on. Oh, that's not that. Not that. I got Kim Kardashian on my screen here. Hold on. I have to ask you something. Never ask your parents what they were doing at your age. What the hell? Mrs. What the hell was that? Hold on one second. I don't know what happened. Ah, uh, here we go. Did you see this? Come here. Let me show you this. You know what he knows. This, this guy. Here are the top 10 most friendly and soft Hey, Pendejo! Does that mean, hey, good friend? <laughs> no, dummy. No? No, you say dummy. Very strong man. Piche <laughs> Wevon. That's him, right? <laughs> yeah. Vale verga. Vale verga? Team leader? <laughs> no. What's that? Stupid. Stupid? Yeah. Stupid. Stupid? <laughs> He knows how to fix things. Yeah. All right. I know what a culero is. I heard it at a soccer game. Everybody was calling it. Okay. Anyway, if you guys want to buy that D Daihatsu dump truck, um, huh? It's a hijack. Oh, but it's not a Daihatsu. It is a Daihatsu. Daihatsu hijack. Okay. It's a Daihatsu hijack. Okay. Call the store, 847-228-1900. Ask for Peter. Ask for Peter, and he'll sell it to you. Uh, I will see you guys live in Las Vegas coming up. What is it? What about a Piche Ojon? I don't know what that is. Anyway, we'll see you in Vegas on Friday. We will. We, there's gonna, there might be a surprise live at the airport uh, Friday morning. I got two hours to kill there when waiting for uh, someone to fly in. So instead of going straight to the strip, uh, strip, Club, or the strip, I'm sorry, the strip. Uh, you're welcome, Kerry. Uh, we're gonna play some lamps in Terminal 1 at United. I think it's Terminal 1. But uh, this is where we're gonna be. I'm having dinner, actually, right here. My hands are dirty, yikes. So, all right, we're out of here.